Welcome to Dorsta. Today we're talking about the American side of VR chat with Jailbait, Romaji, and me. Let's go! I want to know about VR in uh, USA. VR in USA? Well, first of all, it's very confusing. Why is it confusing? Well, you know, for example, t- take me. Can't really tell what gender I am. You know? Hmm. I think that's common in VR chat, though. Tell me, well, um, in VR chat, yeah. It's, it seems like on the Japanese side, it's very common for people to use girl avatars, maybe voice changers. So it can be very diff- The gender lines get blurred. They're like that in the United States, too. Uh, I personally haven't seen many voice changers, but female avatars, a lot of them, yeah. Most of them, actually. Yeah. How do people react? Because, um, like, especially um, gendered language in the United States is kind of taboo. So how do people react on the American side of VR chat? What do they do? Uh, well, since it's so common in VR chat, mm-hmm. they, don't, they don't really react to it at all. Mm, oh, so it's a little bit different to maybe the meat body culture of the United States. Mm, yeah, I suppose. Oh, that's, that's kind of interesting. So, um, are there a lot of content content creators on the U.S. side, do you think? or Do I think? Oh, I definitely know that there's a ton of them. Really? Where do they live? I mean, I mean, I mean <laughs> the, how do you find them? <laughs> they seem... <laughs> they seem <laughs> Let's find them all. Whoops, zip, whoop. I'm falling off. No, oh, no, I guess please, like Twitter please. or something. Mm-hmm. Are, there, are there some that you follow? Are you fans of any? Uh, I'm a fan of myself. Oh, uh, first you and create, foremost. Uh... <laughs> you, you create, or you modify avatars, right? Uh, yeah, I modified this one, actually. Mm-hmm. My outfit. Yeah. So... Um, a biohacker oh. in VR. Oh no, oh no, oh no. How did you how do you do it? You do it in Unity? Uh actually I had to put this I had to take the textures out of Unity and then mm-hmm. put it into an art program and then color over mm-hmm. it. You know? Basically like crayons. I drew all over mm-hmm. this. And that's about the most yeah. I did. Uh, do you ever adjust the geometries and the meshes and stuff like that, or add bones? And I mean, I I do, but the last one I tried that on turned into like spaghetti, so oh, it didn't really yeah. turn out too well. Oh, yeah, something very familiar with spaghetti. <laughs> you got, you mentioned pasta. You got them excited. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go I go look it up for a second. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So, um, um, did you, you have colliders on your front area. Did you put those in yourself or? Uh, no, I just came like that, you know. I oh. was born this way, basically. <laughs> but those are, those are like a really nice touch um, when people have avatars that react like they're a real body where you, they move, they can touch their hair. Pull their dress, skirt, or something. Yeah, I like it. But you know, you know how it is. When you make too much of them, then it starts lagging people out. So this is basically all I have, and a little bit on the hair too. Do you do you feel the U.S. side of VR chat is a little bit dangerous, like a lot of malicious users and things? You know, I've been what? told that is dangerous, but I've mm-hmm. never actually seen any danger. You know. Oh. You, in your chat. You, you, yeah. Well, I mean, the only I mean, danger who... here is calling Tagazan. <laughs> yeah, my face is still dripping from the last Bucha Bucha Bero Bero he gave me. <laughs> 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 Don't you fly!
flash hearts at me, I'll kill you. Um, do you do you use uh, any safe settings when you're out in in the world, or? Uh, a lot of my friends do, but I actually mm -hmm. have it on normal settings. Mm -hmm. Not even you're like great. custom or anything. Wow. Well, I'm, I guess I'm just lucky, because like I said, my friends say they see a lot of, like, quote, mm -hmm. danger, but I don't. Yeah. For, no re mm. for some reason, I don't. You're so brave in terms of your chat community language, because if you don't use safety, it's like uh, going without a condom. <clears throat> Whoa. Whoa, I mean, rated it a proper analogy, yeah. <laughs> eh? Ah, yeah, sure. So, so yeah, so uh, what I said was... This is uh, a real tour style. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, you, you're brave because, yeah, you, you, you enter this world with lots of criminality, criminals that like to, like, spawn some virus into your computer, but you go brave and and adventure yourself into this wilderness that it's the VR chat community. More than well, 40,000 people around the world, and half of them are American. So you're, very, you're, you're, you're brave, as I said, you're very brave. I'm and... not brave, I think it's like my American blood kicking in. Like, if somebody were to threaten me, like finding my address through my IP or something, I would say, hey, come to my front door. You know? Oh, no. She has a gun! Oh no! Oh no! I'll tell him, hey, show oh, no. up. He has oh, a no. what? Oh, gun. Ah, gun. I thought a con. Uh, uh, a what? A con. Like, concentrate. Con, con concentrate. Anyway, then, no, never mind. Um. So you have a gun. According to people. Uh... Oh, just a hunting rifle. Well, that's it. <laughs> How is it not that? Um, jailbait's an American. All Americans have guns, probably. Yeah, legally required ah. to have one, actually. Are, are you from yeah, Texas? This... What? Are, are you from Texas? No, no, no. I'm from the Northeast. Ah. So, I have no idea where the Northeast states. is. Like Maine, New England, New York, that kind of area. Yeah, New York, Boston, I, New Jersey. Ah, uh, New uh, Jersey I people see. are basically like um, uh, Kyushu people, I think. So you have Violent a machine gun, not, not a gun. No, not a machine gun. It just it's five rounds, and it's just one, <laughs> one shot. Uh. You know. Mm. So, uh, have, have you ever killed somebody? <laughs> oh, of course Roma. not. <laughs> ah. Now, maybe you say <laughs> this in a, during a sci-fi movie or post-apocalyptic mm -hmm. oh, yeah, yeah. environment. Well, so, Joby, do you think there's any... What's the trend going on on the US side for creativity? Are people making avatars or are they... Is power, power, not power world, particle worlds really popular now? What, what, what do you think the hot scene is? If I want to go to the American side and see something cool, what, where should I go? Uh, that I know nothing about. I've never seen a particle world before, actually. Oh, really? We'll have to go there sometime. Of course. Yeah. But the avatars, yeah, there's a lot of avatars, yeah. I I guess mm -hmm. they're always making avatars. Are there places where, you... where people show them off, or do you just go to normal worlds and meet people? Uh, I think there's worlds like uh, that sewer level. I don't, I don't remember what it was called, like Dusty or something. Sewer level. Yeah, where it had all those that. avatars and like the pipes across the ceiling and stuff. I don't know it at all. I never seen pipes. Oh. Big Al's Avatar World, I think it's called. Big Al's Avatar World, okay. 
Being oh, good, that's like all I that. know. That yeah. used to get through that through VR home. Oh, no, VR, VRC home. It was one of the portals yeah. there, right? So what's the name of the world? Big Al's Avatar World, I think. Big Girl's Avatar World. Big Al. A big Al. Al? Ah. Al. I was a little surprised to hear how brave Jailbait is. Um, I mean, especially given that I never go to the US side world without my, uh, my safety settings Provision. are full. Yeah. yeah. I tell people where I'm going and when I'm going to be back. <laughs> so they could come looking if I get in trouble. So I'm, I'm really mm. surprised to hear somebody thinks it's pretty safe. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like it, please give us a comment and subscribe our channel. See you in next video.